Narendra Modi inaugurated the third Global Renewable Energy Investment Meeting and Expo Reinvest 2020. He said India is progressively becoming a preferred destination for investment in renewables. In the last six years, nearly Rs 5 lakh crores, or over $64 billion in investment has been made in renewable energy sector in India. We want to make India a global manufacturing hub in the renewable energy sector. Renewable Energy Minister R.K. Singh at CM's plenary session of Third Global Reinvest said India's renewable energy growth unparalleled in the world with continuous support from states. Madhya Pradesh Chief Minister Shivraj Singh Chauhan said that the state has identified land for developing 5,000 megawatts solar parks in Sagar, Morana, Daman Ratlam districts. Rajasthan Chief Minister Ashok Galat said the state will meet the target of 30,000 megawatt solar energy and 7,500 megawatts wind and hybrid power generation by 2024-25. Uttar Pradesh Chief Minister Yogi Adityanath has said that 10,700 megawatt solar power projects will be installed in Uttar Pradesh by 2022. Union Territory of Ladakh has got the largest solar power project set up under the Centers Make in India initiative at La Indian Air Force Station to provide sustainable energy alternative to fossil fuel and traditional methods of energy generation. To save energy, reduce electricity bills and generate revenue from its own resources, South Delhi Municipal Corporation SDMC, planning to tie up with National Thermal Power Corporation Limited for installing solar plants on over 200 buildings, including maternity centers, zonal offices, parking lots and school buildings. Indian authorities will invite competitive bids for close to 22.5 GW of new tenders for solar power projects by December and while about 43 GW of capacity is at different stages of commissioning by successful bidders. Indian Institute of Technology Madras researchers has developed a solar-powered unmanned autonomous survey craft for Indian ports and inland waterways. Solar power tariff recently dropped to an all-time low of Rs 2 per unit in an auction conducted by the Solar Energy Corporation of India.